some mistakes are irreversible and after making those mistakes we all feel like what if i had known that this mistake can lead to a disaster and i could have not committed it right so when you're trying to grow your biotech career obviously you will pass through a lot of hurdles and many a times you might commit some mistakes so today i'm going to tell you top 5 biotech career mistakes which you should never make if you want to grow in your biotech career so to start with the first thing which is a no brainer you should know this very clearly that if you are in a biotech job never ever fight with your supervisor or the immediate boss if there is a disagreement let it be a disagreement but never allow it to become toxic or poisonous but if it is happening like that you know have a face to face discussion and uh, clear things out and if it is still not happening and if you plan to leave that job then do not leave that job unless you have another job at hand unless it is really toxic and you cannot survive for another day of course you then in that case you should leave the job but if that is the case if you are planning to leave your job have a backup quitting your job without a plan or without a backup is a grave mistake because it really takes time to get a job of your choice and if you are leaving your current job switching to the next job it might might take some time and can have a financial repercussion on you and can drain your savings so you should know this second mistake many students make is the moment i say soft skills they'll be like okay this is just communication skills that's not all about soft skills there are multiple types of soft soft skills and networking which you should do so never ever stop learning new soft skills and never ever stop networking so focusing solely on technical skills and ignoring the soft skills is going to have a bad effect on your career never take that lightly soft skills is the pillar on which your technical skills stand so keep that in mind the third mistake you should you should never make while you are in a biotech career is staying too long in your comfort zone today i was talking to somebody and she said that my parents want me to do a job in india and i am in bengaluru but i got a job in netherlands in a biotech company but they're not allowing me to go and i am also thinking that why to go that far and why can't i just do a job in bengaluru so the thing is you may have to sometimes come out of your comfort zone in fact to many of you who are right now thinking that see i'm a wet lab specialist whether i should go for bioinformatics or artificial intelligence machine learning i'm comfortable with my qa qc job or wet lab molecular biology job remember that you will have to get out of your comfort zone otherwise somebody will replace you okay google got too comfortable today chat gpt is about to replace it same way a few years ago you had uh, microsoft versus apple and all these brands we have seen anybody can replace you if you are not learning new things if you're not stepping out of a of your comfort zone so that's very very important and if nobody replaces you at least the computer should not replace you right so always step out of your comfort zone learn new things being loyal to a single role is not going to help you have to learn newer things but the fourth mistake people do when you when they are in a biotech job or they are trying to grow their career is joining unverified or unethical companies now that's something which you should not do always do a background check of course um, the reviews can be rigged people can write r- bad reviews for a good company and people can write good reviews for a bad company so that's something which i will not get into the debate but you should have the conscience to know which is a fake review which is a t- real review okay and uh, join a uh, verified company not a company which is unverified and be very clear with the job description so that later on they just don't say okay you have to do this also that also that can be a big challenge however it's not a problem because of course you learn new things but definitely it is important to know what is your job description and join only verified private limited or limited companies not companies which are unregistered and they can do whatever and they may not pay you salaries so all those things you should know or unethical companies like companies whose founders are not known well or maybe they have no public standing maybe they become unethical down the line so you have to always keep all these things in mind now the fifth point which i have is blindly following the trends without understanding your interest in it i always in my videos say that even if there is a trend today it might be a tradition of tomorrow if you are not interested in it there is no need of learning it okay so if you are not interested fair enough but okay stepping out of your comfort zone is important but if you are not able to comprehend it's okay whatever you is your forte 
you know become experienced in that itself i know my fifth point is probably somewhere contradiction to the uh, third point which which i said staying out of your comfort zone but you know there is a place where you should know that okay if i'm not interested in something even though is this trend is going to be a tradition if I don't have interest I should not pursue okay so don't blindly follow what is being told by me or anyone have your conscience that okay if I am interested then only I should do and if I have time then only I should do so these are the four or five mistakes people do and don't do that instead follow what you like love and would lo- want to do in the future and if you foresee yourself as a person standing in a lab working go for it if you foresee yourself standing in, sitting in front of a computer and working go for it but there are jobs in bio it there are jobs in wet lab every day biotechnica is posting hundreds of jobs and of course uh, various other job portals and linkedin also you get a lot of jobs but you should know that getting a job is easy growing in it sustaining it and passing through the first few years is going to be difficult but once you have passed through your experience and then your life starts settling down around it start earning good amount of money and then the fist little grow but avoid the mistakes which i mentioned in this video today i hope this video was valuable to you let me know in the comment section what other things you should or others should not commit mistakes so that this becomes a good community to help each other thank you so much for watching this video see you soon in the next one till then keep shining take care bye bye